Hey, what's up there? Dan McCall here from Denver, New Jersey. Just want to cut a message real quick for the day. A uh, cool um, business tip. I was just reading um, this in three feet um, from gold. I was actually talking about it a couple weeks ago, and then you know I stumbled on this chapter. And I, you know, I was just thinking about it today. You know, the, and the importance of the message. And um, you know, in that book, there was a chapter that was you know about you know, you know, a, a particular story. And the guy's like main tip was you know to not plan too much. So, you know, that's the big tip, you know, to not plan too much. And he actually put it in this little, like, um, he, he, he put it this way, and I thought, I thought it was really cool the way he put it, and I'm just going to add my own, uh, you know, a little bit of my own input to it, too. You know, he was saying, you know, if you're, like, if you're at your house or whatever, and, and you and you got to take a trip to the other side of the neighborhood or whatever, and you had to do that, you know, you wouldn't want to plan every single little step, you know, because there, there could be a detour, or you know, or you know, some potholes or something, and maybe in, in a particular step or something like that. But uh, you know, but if you you know, if you plan too much, you know, you'll take a while before you would you would actually take a while before you actually left the house. Number one, and number two, once you actually left and followed an exact step per step to get to that other side of the neighborhood, it would take a certain amount of time. So you would spend all that time planning, then you would do every single little step. Now, if you just walked right out your front door and knew exactly where you were going, you know, you might see a skateboard, you know, you know, in the trash that you can hop on. You might, you know, you might see a bicycle in the trash that you can hop on. You know, you might, your friend actually might drive by and give you a lift. You know what I mean? So, so like, that's, that's pretty cool, you know, like, when you, when you think about it like that, because it's always good to, uh, you know, to create metaphors to where you can kind of like uh, get, get a better understanding, you know, what somebody's um, endeavoring to say. Um, I talked about this, you know, on Facebook a few weeks ago, and pe- uh, there was a couple people, you know, with, uh, you know, that, that dropped on there, and they were like, well, you know, what are you just supposed to wing it? You know, it has nothing to do with wing- winging it. I mean, obviously, if you're doing like a specific project that has a one, two, three step, or whatever, you know, that's that's one thing. But I'm, you know, we're, we're talking about uh, goals and uh, you know destinations in life, and uh, you know just certain accomplishments. So you want to make sure that you know where you're going, and and just have that mapped out. And that's the most important thing. Just to be knowing to know where you're going and not worry about all the how tos because you could spend you can actually spend more time getting ready than it actually takes to actually get there. I mean, what if I sat in my house and actually mapped out every single footstep from me me, me to the other side of the neighborhood? By the time I walked out my front door, hopped on a skateboard or something like that, you know, I could have already been there. So, you see what I'm saying? You see the point of the story? So, uh, you know, business tip of the day, you know, don't you know, don't plan too much in your business. This guy can get out there and get started. Get out there and, and make it happen, you know, and make it a great day. Happy uh, hump day. It's Wednesday. See you. Peace.